What's up guys? Welcome back to the Educated Barfly. Today we're going to be making an Enzoni cocktail. This is one of my absolute favorite, hands down, gotta love it, hot weather cocktails. And since it's getting a little bit hotter in LA and we are actually in spring and people have been asking me for hot weather drinks, you're going to get it. The Enzoni was created by Vincenzo Erico in 2003 at the bar, the legendary bar, Milk and Honey. And uh, Erico was actually brought to the US. He was actually a, a Italian bartender working in... Um, uh, he's from Naples and he was working in London. Uh, he moved to London in 1999 and luckily for him, he landed in a bar where his uh, bar mentor was uh, Dick Bradsell. So uh, he met Sasha Petrosky when Sasha was opening the London arm of Milk and Honey and Sasha brought him back to New York City and the rest is history. Uh, I love this cocktail a lot. It is kind of a bitter, sort of dry and lightly sweet um, Kind of gin sour, kind of almost like a gin sour mixed with a Negroni, if that, if you'll, if you will. I don't know. Some of you guys will be like, well, it doesn't have this, it doesn't have that. I don't know. But I think that uh, that's basically what it is. So let's get into it. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna do like five to seven grapes, depending. Uh, these are kind of small, so I'm gonna do seven. And then we're gonna do three quarters of an ounce of lemon juice half an ounce of simple syrup. We're going to do one ounce of Campari. There we go, one ounce. And one ounce of London Dry Gin. We're using Beef Eater. I like to use a really classic London Dry that's got Something that has a lot of lemon peel, but then something that also has like good botanical flavors in it, because I think that the grapes pair really well with those botanicals. And Beef Eater is, as you guys know, one of my workhorse gins. It's low cost, high quality, awesome gin. And we're just gonna muddle the grapes. And just kind of lightly muddle them, but just make sure you, you break them up. And add our ice. Give it an old shake. And then I'm going to take this nice piece of ice that I cut and put it in my old fashioned glass. Actually, it might be a little bit big, but that's okay. And because I like clean presentation, I'm going to double strain our cocktail so we get none of the little pieces. There we go. And then to garnish, I'm just going to take a pick. I'm going to put it on a, on a grape. And then I am going to, I notched this actually, I pre-notched this. So, we're going to stick the pick in like this. And then we're going to hmm. I don't know. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, we could lay it like that. Bam. Perfect. There we go. There's the garnish. All right? And then we're going to taste it. Oh, it's brilliant. It's, it's like you get the grape flavor and you get the bitterness of the Campari, but the bitterness is really balanced out by the citrusy lemon. The citrusy lemon. No, like more like the citric acid of the lemon, that like nice tartness with just a little hint of sugar. Uh, playing into it, it's uh, it is it is bitter, but in a good way, and it's not like that cloying bitterness in the back of your mouth. It's really front of the mouth bitter. Um, it is just, mm, I love it. Let me see. Yeah, oh God, I could crush that. I mean, this is such a great hot weather cocktail. So there you have it, my friends, uh, the Enzoni.